Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and dear board members. My name is Troy Jiang, and uh, I'm currently a senior here. Also, I'm the service club president this year. And before I cut into my main topic today about service, I want to introduce myself a little bit. Um, I was born in a small city with four million people. And, well, it's, it's a city in northeastern part of China, and I guess, I guess that would make sense now. And uh, it is surrounded by North Korea, Japan, and Russia. And because of the political tension there, people, some people joke with me by saying that I might come from the most dangerous place in the world. Uh, in my sophomore year, which was just three years ago, I moved to Nashville, not because I, I think that it's dangerous there. It's because I believe this place will provide me what I think a higher level of education. I left my parents, I left my brother, I came here alone. And after spending two years here, I found something else that is, that is other, other than a good academic program that actually makes the school brilliant. And one word that is mentioned by Mr. Joya, our faculty members and student body very frequently is community. And according to Oxford Dictionary, Community means a group of people living in the same place or having a particular characteristic in common. But today, please let me show you the MBA definition of community. Let's talk about service project first. In this campus, we have various and plentiful opportunities to get involved in service. One service that I was involved with the most is called Christian Taylor. In that service project, we go to a school called Preston Taylor and we help the kids with their homework and spend some time with them after school every Thursday. And since all the kids there knew that I'm from China, so they call me Jackie Chen. <laughs> and, and sometimes they say, hey Jackie Chen, come here, please ping, play ping pong with me. <laughs> and I did that service project in my entire sophomore year. And last year in my junior year, I could not do that service project for four months. And I thought that they would forget about me completely, but when I went back, their reaction completely shocked me. Almost all the kids run to me and say, Hey, Jackie Chen, how are you? Let's play ping pong. I missed you. That was really something I've never heard from other people. And I was really shocked at that moment. And that feeling, still, I can still feel that feeling right here at this moment. And another service project is called Best Body. In this project, we spend some time with people with Down syndrome at MBA. Sometimes we do sports with them. Sometimes we do art. And one day, there's a participant from Best Body. He came to me, showed me a picture, and he tried to explain something to me. But because of my English, I was not able to understand him clearly. And his sponsor came to me and told me that what he was trying to say is that he painted this picture with an MBA volunteer two years ago. And that MBA guy has graduated, and now he misses him. I was completely stunned. Really, I was shocked. And by doing this service, I think we are rewarded emotionally. And we see more perspectives, more aspects of the national community that we never imagined before. And also, we learned how to be a gentleman. That's the first word mentioned in our school model. But if my comment stop, ends here, I would say we are only doing a mediocre job in terms of service and community. The sense of community is also passed to us through our daily life. For example, when someone gets denied by his dream college, the people around him would feel frustrated for him. When we got the news about Mr. Joy's health last semester, Teachers organized us to write hundreds of cards and send our best wishes to Mr. Joya before we took the exam. When Mr. Piggy passed away last year, Mr. Artisan gave us a really touching speech in memory of his colleague in assembly. And when th this happened this semester, when an MBA family, the Fox family's house got burned down, MBA gave them a hand immediately. And they just look around all the buildings around here and our <coughs> roofs and rents. These, these things do not just get built by themselves. And all these things demonstrated to us that the people in this community know how to take care of each other. And that's where our value gets reflected. And I think, and I think from the two stories I told and all these touching stories I mentioned, I conclude that service is not only what we do, 
in service projects. But also, it is what we do in our daily life. MBA is successful because we are good at doing both. And here we learn the true meaning of community, which I define as to engage with each other, with care, sympathy, and understanding. With what we learn about community here, I believe we can march further in the future. And wherever we go, we know we can bring a positive impact to a community. And wherever we go, we know we should take care of each other. And wherever we go, we will remember the place where we learned how to be a gentleman and how to be a good member in a community is called MBA. Thanks for your time. Oh, that, that was a long story. I'll make it short. I attended a school in Shanghai before I came here, and there was an international school conference where I met Mr. Joya there. So I talked to Mr. Joya several times, and I came here as an exchange student for two weeks. You never went home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then, and then I never went home. Uh, I'm living with the uh, host families. I live with one host family each year. Yeah. And Mr. Joy helped me find my first host family, and things just get started and work out automatically after the first year. And what are you planning on doing after you, you graduate? Uh, I will are you going back to China or Spain? So far, my plan is to apply to college here, and uh, after college, I would say, I will, I will see what, what, what will happen there, because a lot of people ask me this question, are you going to stay in China or in America? I said, why not both? Like what I'm doing now. <laughs>